Queen's Indian Defense, Fianchetto, Nemzoitsk Variation, 5.QC2. Intense that was a serious game. That game was pretty competitive. Black played better than White in the opening. That was a well-fought middle game that White got the better of. The players battled pretty evently in the end game. Opening with the Queen's Pawn. The Indian game begins by controlling the important e4 square with the knight, rather than a pawn. By taking control of the crucial d5 square and creating a space on which the knight can move to c3 without obstructing the c-pawn, move c4 helps to create a strong center. The move e6 creates a line for the dark squared bishop, sets up a rapid castle, and prepares to push a pawn to d5 and recover the piece if it is taken. Nf3 develops toward the center, putting pressure on the e5 square and adding another defender to the d4 pawn. The light squared bishop is getting ready to be fianchetto by the queen's Indian defense on b7, where it will affect the long diagonal. The light squared bishop is getting ready to be fianchetto on g2, where it will be positioned on the long diagonal. ba6 immediately attacks the undefended c4 pawn, hoping to provoke b2b3. QC2 develops the queen and protects the c4 pawn. By growing a bishop from its initial square, this activates it. This blocks the check from an opposing bishop. It is the last book move. This exchange is fair. It is ideal. Backs off. It is ideal. Although the score was nearly equal, white now has the upper hand. It is incorrect. This threatens to reveal an attack on a rook. There was only one good move in that position. It is a mistake. By doing this, a knight moves out of its beginning square and into the action. It is ideal. It is a fair deal after all captures. That's good. Recaptures. It is ideal. The rooks are linked by this, making it easier for them to work together in the future. It is quite good. This is not the best approach. It is incorrect. A wise decision. It is quite good. Castling develops a rook while moving the king to a safer position beyond the board's center. Castling to the same side of the board as your adversary helps you escape some of the attacking that comes with castling to the other side. It is quite good. Perfectly on point. It is ideal. This shifts the bishop to a square with more activity, giving it greater scope. It is ideal. While not a mistake, that is also not the wisest course of action. That's good. This gains time by putting a queen in danger and getting it to flee. That's good. This ignores a safer approach to moving a queen. It is incorrect. This misses a chance to link together rooks. It is incorrect. This suggests exchanging items of equivalent value. It is quite good. Not the finest, this. It is incorrect. This is the only move that works. This threatens to fork pieces. It is a great move. This kicks an opposing knight. This threatens to pin a knight. It is best. This poses a risk of winning a pawn. It is incorrect. Only one move worked there, and this wasn't it. This misses an opportunity to connect rooks. It is a mistake. There was just one smart move to be made. That falls flat. This exchange is fair. It is ideal. After all captures, this is an equal trade. This is the only good move. It is best. Backs off. It is ideal. This strikes a rival knight. It is ideal. By growing a queen from its beginning square, this activates the queen. It is ideal. This keeps the material balance in check with good commerce. It is ideal. This exchange is fair. It is ideal. A rook enters the action after developing outside of its starting square as a result. That is good. This makes it impossible for the adversary to gain a pawn. It is ideal. This exposes a pawn attack. It is ideal. This keeps the material balance in check with good commerce. It is ideal. This exchange is fair. It is ideal. Recaptures. 
it is quite good. The queen is therefore moved to safety. This poses a queen winning danger. It is ideal. This offers an equal trade of pieces. This stops the opponent from being able to win a queen. It is best. This keeps the material balance in check with good commerce. It is ideal. Backs off. Black is equal at this point in the end game. It is ideal. This is a missed chance to support a passed pawn with a rook. It is incorrect. The pawn is now on a square that is safer. It is quite good. What I would have advised is that. It is ideal. This exchange is fair. It is ideal. Recaptures. It is ideal. As a result, the adversary may promote a passed pawn. It is incorrect. The moved pawn advances toward its objective. It is ideal. On the file, the rooks are strategically doubled and forcefully combined. It is ideal. The pawn is now adequately defended. This is the only move that works. It is a great move. The pawn is now in a safe position. That's good. This misses a chance to move the king out of the rear rank and activate it. It is incorrect. So, the attacked pawn is protected. It is quite good. By moving it from the back rank, this activates the king in the end game. That's good. The game was almost evenly matched, but black is now worse. It is incorrect. The best choice is this one. It is ideal. There were worse maneuvers, but there were also much better ones. It is incorrect. There was only one good move in that position. This misses an opportunity to threaten winning a pawn. It is a mistake. White had the advantage at first, but now they are in the lead. It is incorrect. This is the only move that works. It is a great move. Very precise. It is best. This is the only good move. It is a great move. Perfectly on point. It is ideal. After all captures, this is an equal trade. This is the only move that works. It is best. What I would have advised is that. It is ideal. The rook is now in a safe position. It is ideal. This misses a chance to defend against an assault on a helpless pawn. It is incorrect. This is the only good move. It is a great move. This moves the checking rook farther away. It is quite good. A powerful play. It is quite good. This moves the checking rook farther away. That's good. It's alright. That's good. This avoids the rook's check. It is ideal. The best choice is this one. It is ideal. This moves the checking rook farther away. It is ideal. Very precise. It is best. This avoids the rook's check. It is ideal. That's a decent move. That's good. This suggests exchanging items of equivalent value. It is quite good. Perfectly on point. It is ideal. This moves the checking rook farther away. It is ideal. The rook is now on a square that is more secure. That's good. This moves the checking rook farther away. It is quite good. What I would have advised is that. It is ideal. This poses the risk of producing a passed pawn. It is ideal. This stops the opponent from being able to create a passed pawn. It is excellent. This avoids the rook's check. It's compelled. This misses a chance to link together rooks. It is incorrect. The pawn is now passed because it can no longer be opposed as it attempts to promote by other pieces. It is quite good. While not a mistake, that is also not the wisest course of action. That's good. This is not the best approach. It is incorrect. Not the finest, this. It is incorrect. This moves the checking rook farther away. It is ideal. This is the only move that works. It is a great move. This poses a checkmate threat. It is incorrect. This prevents the adversary from playing checkmate. It is ideal. 
This avoids the rook's check. It is ideal. This is the only good move. It is a great move. This avoids the rook's check. That's good. The best choice is this one. It is ideal. This poses a rook kicking threat. It is ideal. This makes it impossible for the adversary to kick a rook. It is ideal. This moves the checking rook farther away. It is ideal. Now that the rooks can see one another, they can defend one another. It is quite good. A passed pawn is pushed by this. It is quite good. An opponent's passed pawn can't advance if a rook is positioned behind it. This raises the possibility of an eventual checkmate. It is ideal. The rook is now in a safe position. It is ideal. This is how you take the pawn. It is ideal. This moves the checking rook farther away. It is quite good. Very precise. It is best. This avoids the rook's check. It is ideal. Perfectly on point. It is ideal. This moves the checking rook farther away. It is ideal. Among the best actions. It is quite good. This reveals an attack that poses a threat to a rook. It is ideal. What I would have advised is that. It is ideal. This avoids the rook's check. It's compelled. This keeps the material balance in check with good commerce. It is ideal. Backs off. It is ideal. It's alright. That's good. The moved pawn advances toward its objective. A passing pawn could be promoted as a result of this. It is quite good. This makes it impossible for the adversary to advance a passed pawn. It is ideal. This divides up parts by launching multiple attacks at once. It is ideal. This avoids the rook's check. It is quite good. The best choice is this one. It is ideal. There was only one move that was effective, and this wasn't it. It is incorrect. Very precise. It is best. This is the only good move. It is a great move. This could have been done lot better. It is incorrect. A passed pawn is pushed by this. It is ideal. That is a logical response. It is quite good. This moves the checking rook farther away. It is ideal. A wise decision. It is quite good. That's a decent move. That's good. While not a mistake, that is also not the wisest course of action. That's good. This moves the checking rook farther away. That's good. This suggests using a rook to block a pawn that has been passed. It is ideal. There was just one smart move to be made. It is incorrect. This gives the adversary the opportunity to promote a passed pawn. It is incorrect. A passed pawn is pushed by this. It is ideal. A powerful play. It is quite good. Among the best actions. It is quite good. That is a logical response. It is quite good. Perfectly on point. It is ideal. An opponent's passed pawn can't advance if a rook is positioned behind it. It is quite good. That's what I would have recommended. It is best. Intense that was a serious game. That game was pretty competitive. Black played better than white in the opening. That was a well-fought middle game that white got the better of. The players battled pretty evently in the end game.